I feel honored to speak a few words today about Dr. Wang um, on behalf of the Chinese Canadian Culture Society in Port Montgomery, which he, which he has presided over for many years. As we know, Dr. Wang has been a volunteer, director, and president for more than 30 years in this town. And seven years ago, when I first met Dr. Wang at Fort McMurray, I was not quite impressed at my first sight. You know, he was not that quite glaring type of society leader that I have met before. And he wasn't even very physical appealing uh, to represent a great leader in a society. Sometimes he was even a little bit dry. Uh, he kept murmuring, talked a lot about the history of the Chinese society and the Chinese school. Just keep talking. And uh, just like talking about his baby still, but don't care whether I want to listen or not. <laughs> but, but that's right. He treated the Chinese society and the Chinese school like his babies. And he, took care of them like a big daddy. And was he a big daddy? He looks tiny and small. <laughs> but if you judge him by his size, you're probably wrong. He had a tremendous energy and enthusiasm, just like a volcano, for the things he loved. And his work, his people, his society, the school. I just hope he did not forget himself and his family. He's a giant to us in his work and in his society. So if not his effort, his dedication, his love, and his persistence, if you look back, the Chinese society would not have survived a huge turnover in 2007. That happened to this town. A lot of senior directors have left the position and uh, went to Calgary. And, uh, element and we were worrying whether the society would not be able to survive and school would not would have to be closed. But really if not him, our Chinese school would have been closed, not to mention anything about sixty students in our school today. It's, our school is really prosperous now. Thanks to him. And if not him, we would not be able to entertain the city with a real wonderful Chinese New Year celebration every year that frankly might have been stopped from seven years ago. So now Dr. Wang has left us, but his spirit for the community will be with us and we shall continue. We will follow his steps to hold the community prosperous, to keep the Chinese school moving forward, and we make our promise that we will entertain the city again with our 35th annual Chinese New Year banquet in 2015. We feel so indebted to Dr. Wong, but uh, there's nothing really we can do for return because he didn't ask for anything for return. But there's one thing that we can do, and probably that's the only thing that we can do. We would like to honor him by naming the photo memory Chinese language and heritage school after his name. So the Chinese school will now become the Dr. P.T. Wang Memorial Chinese School. I would like to borrow a poem for one of our senior Chinese society director, Yun Tong, for this moment. And he wrote, a blessing star shines the town of the OSNs, gentle and warm-hearted greeting the new lives. Long live him for the society of the Chinese. Feeling warm whenever we thought him in our hearts. Thank you, Dr. Wang. Thank you for the family. For everything you have done for us, for the Chinese society, for the Chinese school. You live in our memory. For, for us, you are the city of Fort McMurray. Thank you.